they all had different personalities, 100%. Biggie's an explorer. He needs to see what's going on all the time. Scar's just a lone ranger, like he doesn't really want to be bothered. And then Princess was their guard. Babes? Babe? But if I buy them a toy, I put it down immediately, they jump on it together. Just watching them. It's like a cat when you open a box. They're like, oh, what is this? So as soon as you have the empty box, you're jumping in. It's like having a dog and a cat mixed into one. During COVID, I came home from work and my husband said, you have to see what I found in our shed. So I go over, he opens this cooler that we used to cut out for stray cats. And then there were three baby groundhogs and two of them weren't really moving. I was like, okay, well the mom should be back. So I started walking and then we seen her belly up in the front yard. And I was like, what am I gonna do? Called the wildlife. I did talk to the game warden. He was like, well, you can't really release them because they were babies when we found them. So I just went to the local farm store and bought kitten's milk. And that basically the rest of history, they were never wild. So they're completely litter trained. They love playing like little kids. We have a garage all set up for them with toys and fake grass and picnic tables. They have campers, dump trucks. They love other toys. So for the dump truck, that's probably gonna be the easiest toy that I can explain. They'll push the car around like they're driving it. And then they'll flip it completely over. I have little cedar blocks and they would take the cedar blocks off the table and stack them on the little boardwalk. I'm like, you guys are insane. I didn't expect to be taking care of them three years later, but the big groundhog community and the game warden that I have on Instagram, I'll give a little pointers on what to do when you have a question about them. You can't be in a bad mood when you're around them. It's impossible. I got really lucky having them. It's an experience of a lifetime. It's time to watch more.